Hey people, this is Wii187, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy XII International Zodiac Job System in English. In the last video, we were um, getting out of the Lucy Mines because we did the Nidhogg Hunt, and yeah, that's about it. We did the Nidhogg Hunt, we went and bought some protectives, um, wrapped up the story, and now we have to go rescue Ash and... Take me to him, yes, we gotta go see the Marquis. Ash and Penelo. Are you ready for your audience, Badra? Yes, I'm ready. I don't know what Badra means. His Excellency the Marquis is otherwise occupied until sunset. Please, I will show you to a place where you may wait in comfort. Awesome. Like a hotel room or something? I wish they, like, showed it. But it time skips ahead. So, Bosch von Ronsenberg. It was not so very long ago that I announced you had been executed. And that is the only reason I draw breath. Anger. So you are the sword he strung above my head. Vane has left not a thing to chance. And? A leader of the resistance has fallen into Imperial hands. A woman by the name of Amalia. I would rescue her, but I need your help. This resistance leader, this Amalia, she must be very important. Oh, yes. You understand I have my position to consider. Would you let us see Larsa? He's got my friend with him. I'm afraid you're too late. Lord Larsa's cortege has already rejoined the Imperial Detachment. I am told they will depart for Rabanaster upon the arrival of the fleet this eventide. <sighs> Oh well. Yay for good cutscene. This basically shows, I think, just the Imperial um, fleet just sort of coming upon Bujerba. What are we waiting for? for? you to calm down. Captain Ronsenberg, surely the exigencies of position are not lost on you. Why, indeed, you should find the enemy's chains an easy burden to bear. Wait. Sorry. Can't be helped. Summon the guard. And the Marcus will summon the guard and we get taken away. They are to be taken to Judge Geese. Now for those of you who don't get that, basically what happened is the Marquis said, Surely you're not not used to being locked up anymore, you know, like you're still used to that, right? And Bosch is like, Oh, I see what you're doing. And they um get locked up, but the Marquis is planning so they fools in our case. Basically, they will get locked up so that way they can go rescue um, the people that we need to rescue that the Empire is holding. Basically. So it's all a plan. It is time, my hands, and look what happens. I tell you, this country's obstinacy knows no bounds. The insurgents in Rabanasta operate alone at present. However, should they garner external support, the situation could worsen. We have found the counter-imperial elements in Bujerba to be conspicuously well-funded. No doubt Marquis Ondo is behind this. These are our baddies. By the way, the Marquis has written us a letter. A letter. He claims that he's recaptured our runaway. He's given him to Geese. He will die by my hand. Your fraternity is moving. Ah, Geese returns with Larsa. Tomorrow morning they will leave Bujerba. See him home safely, Gabranth. Now I'm expecting Dr. Sid. You may leave. And here is Dr. Sid. Dr. Sid is... Nabadis taught us much. Yeah. In my opinion, the best Sid in all of Final Fantasy. This Sid is the best. The reins of history back in the hands of man. He's crazy. Ah, Vane. 
You seem to be enjoying your job as consul. I was kept waiting fully two years. What news of Arcades? Our honored members of the Senate. Hard at work, as always. Trying to find a dagger for your back. Mm. <laughs> they are welcome to try. Yeah, like I said, this Dr. Sid is crazy. Like, he is like a madman. He is like... Like, Kefka crazy. That's how crazy he is. Like, if you've seen Kefka... Well, not as crazy as Kefka. But he's up there. He's really insane. He won't be as important until later. Like, much later on in the, in the story. When he does, he will be very important. But they just wanted to introduce him early. But, you know, he won't actually become significant for quite a while. I'm sorry, people. The stupid dazzle that I used to record froze again as I was recording so you missed that little scene basically what happened is Vaughn and them you know uh, they all got taken into the airship and that's really all that happened in the scene it was just showing them being transported you saw half of it anyway let's continue the dreadnought leviathan all summons from the series have been turned into airships. And there are new airships now. Or new summons now, sorry. Now watch this scene closely as I call what's going to happen. You're going to hear a slap. One, Majesty. two, one, two, three, four, go! Okay, After awesome. After what you've done, how dare you? You're supposed to be dead. I love that so much. Come now, come now. Have you forgotten your manners? This is hardly the courtesy due the late Princess Ashalia Benagin Dalmasca. Princess? Yeah, as I said before, Amalia is be Ash. Sure. She bears no proof of her former station. So, yeah. No different than any mean member of the insurgents. We all knew this. The resistance. His Excellency the Consul asks the Ministry of the Disthroned Royal Family in restoring peace to Dalmasca. Those who foster instability and unrest who claim royal blood without proof, they shall meet their fate at the gallows. There are no exceptions. I will not play puppet to vain. King Ramanas entrusted me with a task. Ash is my Should favorite character. Come, he In bade me give you something of great importance. All of Final Fantasy. It is your birthright, the Dusk Shard. It will warrant the quality of her blood. Only I know where to find it. Wait. You took my father's life. Why spare mine now? You would have me live in shame. If that is your duty, yes. Stop being so stubborn. Keep on like this and you're gonna get us all killed. Don't interrupt. She said it again. What? I love it when she says, don't interrupt. Vaughn, that stone. It was in the palace treasure. Well, well. I like how it's just like holding it the whole time. Splendid. You brought the stone with you. This spares us a great deal of trouble. Don't give it to him! Uh, Indecisiveness. Uh, you have to promise. No executions. A judge's duty is to the law. Take them away. My lord. Lady Ash is to be quartered separately. Oh no, it's like... It's like FF7 all over again, you know. They all get locked up when they try to break into the Shinra Manor. Not Manor. Shinra Building. Headquarters. In Disc 1. Good times, good times. I need to play FF7 again. I haven't played it in a really, really long time. And I should. I do like it. Not as much as this game, but I still like it. So you were carrying it all along. The fates jest. <sighs> Tell these fates of yours to leave me out. <laughs> there was nothing else that I could do. You know that. Oh, I understand. Honor, duty, and all that. I still can't believe that was a <laughs> And random fight back. You go, Fran. And here's Vossler. He's back. The Marquis has been busy. Not lightly did I beg his aid. Listen, 
It has been a full two years. I alone have kept Her Majesty safely hidden. I doubted friend and foe alike. I could trust nobody. You did your duty, and mine for me. I'm getting her out. I need your help. Of course. So, as I said before, Vossler would eventually join our party as a guest, and, you know, he did. And this isn't the, this isn't the only time. This is only the first time. He'll be our, in our party for a short while now. Um, but then he'll rejoin again later and be there for a while longer. But now we have stuff to do. We have to go rescue Ash, and we have to go rescue Pinello, and it's all crazy. And he's going to tell us about Wait, the lasers. A word of caution before we set out. See that red web of light spanning the passageway? It is a mechanism to detect intruders within the ship. Break one of those beams and an alarm will sound, summoning the guard. The alarm should cease after a time, but it's better to avoid drawing unnecessary attention. Come, Her Majesty awaits. And Valsir is like, yeah, okay. So, uh, not much time left in the video because there is a lot of cutscenes to get through. But, you know, it's okay. Um, we are, we actually are going to end up breaking one of those beams, but not yet. See, they're all running like crazy trying to find us, and we are going to sneak up on you. How did you dodge that? There you go. Alright, now, um... We gotta go this way. I'm gonna keep it on super speed because there's not much time left. So you wanna just continue on through here, and then you take a right here. Although this treasure chest is actually kind of hard to get but not impossible because you gotta run to it get it it's all oh, it's only a potion it could be something better and run back fast because if you notice right after boom the lasers get put there I wish it was something better than just a potion but you know oh well and by the time we finish with this dungeon we'll actually be uh, we'll have our whole party together for the rest of the game now you want to go south this way a little bit. Not much time left in the video, so we're going to have to, you know, cut it kind of short. And maybe finish this area in the next one, or the one after, depending on, you know, how long we take. But it's okay. Because we are going fast. And if you know, oh yeah, you can control Vossler now. He's a real, um, he's pretty strong. You know, he can attack pretty well. Uh, but I personally want to control Bosch. And you run over here. Let's kill these guys really quick. Treasure. Reflect Gamo. Okay. Potion. Alarm clock. And another Reflect Gamo. So, not terrible. And 236 skill. There's one more chest over here. Oh, ah. We actually, for this chest, we are going to... I'm going to bring in Vaughn because... Come on, game. All right. Um, let's see. Oh, it was just a knot of rust. It could have been a really nice equipment for this stage of the game, but oh well. Um, continue out this way, and we're almost halfway through this area. It's really fast. But there's only, like, around a minute left in the video... So, what I'm going to do, I think we're going to end it now. And, you know what? No, we're going to run through. I'm not going to end it yet. We're going to run through and get to the other side. Let's see if we can get to the other side before the video ends. And then we'll save the boss fight for the next video. we got 30 seconds. Come on. Die. There we go. Stupid dog is here to stop us. 20 seconds left. Alright, let's run, run, run. Um, I'll see you next time. And since I'm probably not going to be able to say bye since we're running so fast. But, you know, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next video where we take on um, a little mini boss thing. See ya.